Welcome back to Crossout and welcome back to more episodes of your user submitted builds. Once again, we are checking out all of the submit missions on the exhibition with the buns tag on them. There are plenty of tutorials from still, so thank you so much to everyone who uploads these and continues to upload. I chose three different builds today. This pork sandwich thing by Pikis Gaming. Then we have this dual LB build here by Yugov. And finally, this dual Fat Man sideways hover by Wojtek. We're going to try out these three today, give them a go. And we're going to start with the pork wagon because who doesn't like himself some proper nice pork action. And I don't think we've ever played these in anything else than just maxed out a power score so this is going to be something just a little bit different to give that a run as well the power score is just around 8000 and it's one of these like really slim ones so hopefully these goliaths can protect us for some time Besides that, the build by Yugov here, the dual LB build, is uh, 5,800 5, power score, which is also decently low for these weapons. So we should be able to bash out some 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 good kills with that one as well. And then finally, 10,447 on this thing. Just had to re-change re the hovers on this because the old ones were red hovers and those are just so incredibly slow so just chose the blue ones instead but besides that nothing is really changed to any of the builds i think this one might have also had like one founder's part which i still don't have on my promo really crossing my fingers that i get them very soon but nothing that really changes the build we should be golden and i feel like we should just get started so here we go with the first game in the pork sandwich on bridge so i feel like we um we, we should either try to see if we can just lob some porks over there and hopefully get some kills as they rush over the bridge or see if we can get some porks down into the river well now let's just unload a bit here hopefully those will roll to the bridge doesn't look like anyone is going we have one mate who is just you know Full on Rambo mode over there. Just gonna send it. YOLO it. Don't give a damn. Going over there. Some guy literally disconnected just from the sheer terror of him rushing straight into them. And he literally grabbed two kills as he died. Oh, that wasn't him. But we got two kills from the distraction. So, I mean, I guess we should take that. That was... Yeah, I have no idea what just happened there. But I'll take it. And inevitably, he died. But it's fine. It's fine. We have someone coming over here now. And for some reason, we can't really... The build stops whenever we're trying to turn. So that's also very interesting. But we are going to run down here into into the water and drop a cap can. Because, because we can. And just instantly, they are self-inflicting 900 damage. Also, because we can, um, I'm going to see if we can maybe just, you know, poke here. Going to be lucky. Some dude jumps down. Can we get some pokes onto the ramp here? I think we can. You know, we are a sandwich and we see someone coming down there. Just gonna poke him for a bit. There we go. He instantly popped there. Is he gonna pop us though? Nope, because he is gonna burn down and they only have two people over here. So let's get down there and see if we can get anything done before this game is over. And there's a rammer, which we killed. Perfect. <laughs> and one more with the poke before we switch. Power plane this time, which also gives us some really, really nice lanes that we can poke up. As we approach the enemy here, let's see where they want to go. Well, you know what? Actually, we have two people going mid. Can we just get some fast pokes rolling over this edge here? No, we cannot. But on the other hand, we can get them slowly coming in here. So I want to just get Capcans down. I want to be careful about that dude coming this way. Ooh, nails him nicely with the pokes. Get Capcan. There we go. Did indeed get Capcan, and he is very dead. Oh my goodness, Pokes are strong at this power score. I think there are a lot of people running Gaskins here, and which to some extent describes why we are, you know, feeling rather strong in here. What is that? Is that a dude? Oh my god, the Pokes there, those were very deadly indeed. I don't wanna I don't wanna get out here because it's gonna be horrible trying to close in the gap on that dude. Nice one. Alright, his focus is there, so maybe we can go this way. Oh. Ow. Just hit myself for 900 damage there. Not very not very nice. Oh, okay, he popped as well. Well beautiful that. That indicates another gas can, but you know, we'll definitely take it. There we go. We flip, we're not flipped. Okay, we up yep, we flipped again. Nope, we're not flipped. We're still doing good here. 
I'm not ideal, not really sure what's going on there, but he died and we got two kills and everything is great and we won. Nice. <laughs> right on into the dual LB build here by Yugov and we are back on bridge. So, that means we all know that the LBs and Fatmans and the Mammoth Arch is secretly the best sniping weapons in the game. So that is what we're gonna do. That is what we're gonna do. You know what? I wanna see if we can get like mid range here and brawl just a bit. Absolute beautiful miss there. Good hit though. Oof, another good hit as you can see. Absolutely wonderful sniping weapon. I do sense that they have a typhoon over there from that stun that I got, or not stun, but weapon slow cooldown thingy as I got hit there. The blue, the, the blue debuff as you saw on this. So they have a Typhoon dude over there, which is uh, a bit scary, but not really, because Typhoons are not that scary in general right now. Actually, they are like quite crabby, some would say. And we have a shotgun watch over here. Are we going to get wedged in this thing? Highly likely, but we are going to just recklessly chase him down anyway. Okay, no idea what he's playing. Is that an Arathron? I think it is. Yeah, it is indeed an Arathron. We should be a decent brawler here, though. So let's see what we can do. Oh, yep, absolutely. We just took off his weapons. Is he demoing? I don't know if he's demoing. Did we take that weapon? We didn't take that weapon. Let's just grab the kill here and go grab the door as well as we demolish this dude. Nope, absolutely not. One hit more and then he is down. There we go. Absolutely not. Okay, I'm going to be back. And he managed to kill himself. Perfection. So, let's see. They have one guy left. Not anymore. We win again. <laughs> and another game with the tiny tank here. Uh, I have no idea what we are going to do this time. I think we're just going to let the bots sort of drive, you know, into everything here. And then let's see if we can just get some early damage in, you know, get those easy butt kills that'll make us look like we are good because we can get points good hits here good hits all around if you can get their butts down early then we should out oh, that really hurt stop 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 let's see that's the dude from before oh goodness all right we i don't know what to do here right now i feel like we're in kind of a crappy position here at the moment and adam just being an absolute bully to us Okay, he is dead. That's very good. I don't know if we can really contest that dude, but I, I, I am... I am gonna try. I am gonna try. Let's see. Let's see, 200 damage there. That's not really ideal. It's not really close to ideal. Can we wedge him, though? We can't, but we can push him around for a bit and then hit ourselves for a lot of damage there. Which is also not ideal. Does he have something explosive in there? He did. Very good. And dig on him. Very even much better. And kill him as well. There we go. First kill. And Adam is back. That's the bully from before. Can we go get our go, get our vengeance on him before he dies? To our teammates here. I think we can. Alright, these dudes are still not dead. Oh! Oh my god, and he hits he hits the e-break just like that, but we, we still won, so it's okay into the final build and the final two games which will be with this sideways fat man hover made by Wojtek. I kind of want to just see if we can get somewhat close to them in this build but without going so close that we put ourselves in the middle of the fight but we are a hover so we we, we don't want to get like bashed too hard immediately. We have They do have someone here who has supposedly spotted that we are going in that direction so Let's, let's give him a little bash here with the fat mains and enjoy our terribly tragic accuracy with this weapon on any sort of cover build. I have no idea where those... I literally don't know where those assemble shots are coming from. I literally have no idea. Oh, he's down there. Okay, well, yep. He is still having a go at us. Kind of kind of exploded there quite quickly. Let's do that again. <laughs> And let's get started with the last game of this video. Let's just try to stick back a little bit and hopefully we won't get instantly demolished by an assembler. Which, by the way, is just so incredibly strong. I don't feel like they're like super OP or anything like that, but they are 
they are really strong so i've seen that in the test server they are giving them just a tiny bit of a damage nerf and still can't really figure if they're just doing that because they want to bring down the overall damage numbers of weapons in this game because a lot of weapons are actually getting hit or if it's mostly just that is another assembly right there i could tell that for sure uh, or if they're just trying to you know nerf specific weapons it's hard to tell well we'll have to see as we we keep going here dang it i thought that assembly was going to push into their base he was not but should still be able to help out with him there we go he is out of the game perfect and we don't have to worry about that meaning that we can focus on other things for example this guy good hit there is he d gun i think he is d gun someone should come around this corner here right now he does that's a bot okay um maybe we want to start okay that's a bot too you know what we're gonna choose the george the bot then can we ram his gun that was a terrible attempt at ramming but we are going to take it anyways. I do feel like there is a player down here. That aggressive chase right there. Seemed a bit more like a player than anything else. Oh my god, dude. Stop. Stop. Oh god, you can just continue shooting, huh? Do you ever run out of shots? There, now you do. Okay, and another... The Batman player here chasing us. Ah, uh, we do have something burning in there. See, I would probably pay some attention to that shotgun wedge on you there, but if you want to pay attention to me, that's also fine, because then we can get the kill. Do you have something explosive under there? You do. It's very nice, so let's grab that. Oh, and cloak up, because we have someone there that is Alec the butt. And then we also have that thing right there, which is... Oh, God. No, 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 no. That's going there. He carries a lot of drones. Let's just hide. Let's just hide for now. I kind of want those drones to focus someone else before we go do anything. All right, he's running over there now. We should be golden in this. Like we should be fine. We just, we just need to see what they kind of want to do here. Ooh, honestly, thought we were gonna get the hit there, but apparently we weren't. Hello there. There he is. Oh, and another good hit. And fire one more. Okay, nope. This one, though. There we go. Beautiful. So that was it for today's video. Once again, thank you so much for submitting all of these builds. And do keep them coming. I really want to see what you guys can come up with. And I enjoy taking all of your builds to battle. So don't forget to submit your own builds with the tag Bunts on the exhibition. And I will try to give as many of them a look as possible. I think the build that I had most fun with and just felt most enjoyable as I was playing was probably the the bulk brick sandwich thing here. Um, so yeah, that's going to take away the unofficial price of being the most entertaining build of this video. But if you feel like you can compete with that, do submit your own. Thanks so much for watching and until next time, bye bye.